Cookstop is, is this wonderful device that's in the kitchen. And basically what it does is it watches over the stove in case you for, should forget or leave. And it will uh, gently shut off the stove so that you don't have any fires. If you've ever asked anybody, and you can try this, ask almost anybody in the street or people that you know, have you ever had a problem or do you know somebody who's had a problem leaving the stove unattended and either had a fire or nearly had a fire? Cookstop relieves this issue by turning the stove off. With Cookstop, you know the stove is gonna be off if you're not paying attention to cooking. One of our friends, Mary, told me, I don't really need a Cookstop. I'm not forgetful. I never leave my cooking unattended. But upon the assistance of her children, she installed the Cookstop device in her kitchen. When she leaves the kitchen and she comes back, what she thinks is in a short period of time, she sees that the stove is turned off. She said, Cookstop is always there watching out for her. What Cookstop lets you do is you can cook longer. I estimate somewhere between one and five years before you lose your right to cook. And this is all about having your faculties or having somebody else uh, look over your shoulder so that if you should slip one day, you know, forget to shut off the stove, Cookstop will shut it off for you. We decided to build Cookstop for a couple of reasons. One is the number one cause, according to the National Fire Protection Association, of home fires in the U.S. is unattended cooking. Cookstop's most sensitive technology is an adjunct or an additive to fire extinguishers, sprinkler systems. Cookstop's motion sensor technology is a proactive solution, while the fire extinguishers and sprinkler systems are all reactive systems. Well, the reason we use motion sense technology is, A, it's, it's very, very stable. It's been around for quite a while. And B, what we find is, as a proactive solution, it not only does the job it's supposed to do, because if somebody's not in the kitchen, it turns off the stove, but we also find from a behavior standpoint that the presence of Cookstop tends to increase people's attention. Inside Cookstop, there's actually a pretty good brain. It's got uh, some reasoning going on, some nice algorithms. I love technology, but what I want to do with Cookstop is take that technology and make it more pervasive, allow it to communicate, uh, allow it to give information back to maybe the, the children or if you're in a situation where you're in a senior home such as where my mom is it would give information back to the, the management so that they can keep better tabs better understand the, the patterns the living patterns the cooking patterns of their residents the cookstop device was designed with you in mind basically you have minimal interaction with the cookstop device when you come into the kitchen, you turn on your stove as normal and cook as normal. However, if you should leave the kitchen while cooking, the Cookstop device will shut off the cook stove. And when you come back in, all you have to do is push cook. So in addition to working right out of the box, Cookstop is highly configurable. Originally, we created Cookstop for seniors, but we realized in, in, in talking with customers that there's, there's other applications for it. Uh, children who are growing, just beginning to learn to cook, uh, college environments where you may have uh, drinking or other things going on and uh, you could have a situation where people are unattended. I think we're bringing something that's leading edge to the marketplace. And the beauty of the products, not just the technology, but the, the ability to integrate it into the home in a very seamless fashion.